students how are you today we will learn to make figures four face figures five face figures and six face figures so for this we need some paper a scale a pencil an eraser and a scissor now let's start now first of all we will make a four faced figure for this we will take a paper then let us draw a diagram on this paper with help of pencil and scale now we have drawn a triangle on this paper now we will draw a smaller triangle by marking the midpoints on these three lines now we will label the sides of triangle so let us name this point a this b this one c now we have how many parts of this figure 1 2 3 4 now we will cut this figure with help of scissor now we will fold the paper along the sides a b b c and a c so first of all we will fold along a b now b c and now a c now we have made a pyramid so this is the pyramid we have formed now let us count the faces of this pyramid one face second face third face and fourth face so this is a four faced figure next we will make a five faced figure for this again we will take a paper and let us draw a figure on this paper with help of pencil and scale now we have drawn a rectangle and we will divide this rectangle into three equal rectangles now three equal rectangles are drawn and now from the middle rectangle we will draw a triangle on both sides now we have drawn a diagram now we will label the sides of this rectangle so this one a b c and d now let us count the parts of this diagram 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 Now let us cut this diagram with help of scissor. Now I have cut the diagram. Now we will fold this along the sides A, B. Then along the sides C, D. now fold it along the side b c and a d now let us join this and a five faced figure is formed let us count 1 2 3 4 and five so this is a five faced figure called prism now we will make a six faced figure so again for this we will take a paper and draw a diagram with help of pencil and scale on this paper 
Now we have drawn a rectangle on this paper and now we will divide this rectangle into four equal rectangles. After dividing it into four equal rectangles, we will draw squares on the both sides of the second rectangle. Now name the sides of rectangle A, B, C and D. Now let us count the parts of the diagram. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now we will cut this diagram with help of scissor. Now we will fold the diagram along the sides A, B, Now along the side C, D, along the side B, C and along the side A, D. Now let us join this. Now we have got a cuboid. Now let us count the faces of this cuboid. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So this is a 6 faced figure called cuboid. Now you have learned to make 4 faced, 5 faced and 6 faced figures. Now in your homework you will take plain paper and make these figures. Thank you.